Thank you very much. Uh, part of the Sir, I have just met with the president. Who said so? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we are at the presidential villa. I take that back. We are at the presidential villa. What are you here for? Uh, well, I came to see the president. Uh, this is uh, my the director of the Kuka Center, Father Atta. Uh, so we came to discuss with the president uh, an invitation we had earlier extended, which we renew. Uh, to have a conference in which we would like him to be in attendance uh, addressing the theme of national cohesion. So that's really what we came to discuss. President Bola Tinobu is clocking one year in office in a couple of weeks. Um, would you be kind enough to tell us what you feel? We know you're someone who has been vocal about Nigeria's past presidents. Can you assess President Bola Tinobu for us? Well, I'm sure many people will tell you that one year is... Uh, it's not enough to make a judgment. However, from where we all stand, uh, we know that we are all in a very difficult situation. Uh, Nigerians are in various levels of pain, um, and there are pains that are unintended. But that there is also certain policy decisions that hopefully uh, with time can be amended in order to serve the welfare of ordinary people. I believe that the essence of government is to guarantee the welfare and security of ordinary citizens. Um, I believe that the times that we're in now are very, very difficult times and nobody should be under any illusion. But there are also times for renewal, you know, we just need to commit ourselves to the fact that building a good society takes a lot of time. It's not something that is done in one lifetime. And for me, the most important thing is for us to continue on the building blocks of the things that we think are being done well. My argument has always been that the government needs to very quickly improve the quality of communication so that Nigerians can at least get a sense of how long is it going to be before food is ready. Yeah, no, I mean, you are concerned about uh, national cohesion. But many Nigerians are afraid that the uh, crisis in the West can you know, blow up into such as... Well, for the for no, I don't live in River State. If you if you meet the, I mean, look, this is politics, and very often we ordinary people cry more than they believe. The important thing is that politicians will fix their problems. Uh, River State is a place that is very dear to me because I've been associated with them for a very long period of time. But look, I mean, when politicians uh, fight, don't get carried away because they, will, they have their capacity to fix their quarrels. Uh, and I hope and pray that River State will sooner than later reposition itself because it is not an insignificant part of Nigeria. Thank right? you very much, sir. Thank you.